awo rin kan ile ni su guju bi ile ikute ah eh eh ibi ba ju ba dele ha si pada le to emi ha mo nta la lo mo nlu la si kan ni se ibi ta mo wo na ri Ogbo o se eh ka to ma bo ati dem la to do wa abo ti ni mo wi se nbe ni koda iyan fofun lele bayi la je inu wa ti kun e se won adupe e mo fa nje ku jeje ah ah mama je ku je bi ti bo Eh ba wa fifeje eh fifeje kini mo ni omo se yonu abi ta n do nje aja to gbe kale to n pe lo nje kai e ya de to ji omo gan ti e ba so mali si oye o ti dele ilataro eh ko si kuku ni koko o se kan ati se Mami, ekule. Ta mami. Ta ba ni ku le nko. Fenja. E mo ni ta ba ni ku le nko. Se bi awon bi won ti so o fi ran ni alabule. Eh yi le ta ni o wa ko fun o ko eh eh ki le ta bi kale ta la bi mo yi ah kas atun wa gbera la tabule atun wo wa lu la iyawo re tun amunje aja o tun fi se alaleju Baby, Oda. <coughs> 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 <coughs>
My dear? I used to thinking about it. I have never been so humiliated in my life. I know. But all we can do is to trust in God. You've been withdrawn since they left. You also refused to eat your dinner. Which dinner? Which food? Didn't you hear what they called it? Dog's food. They even refused to sleep in our house. <sighs> but do I blame them? Where would they have slept? They said I'm a failure for not building them a house in the village. Oh, I pity myself. Yeah. Don't be too hard on yourself. The children and I know you are making efforts. Let's just pray that one of those companies will call you for a job soon. I know that God will definitely reward your labor in his vineyard. Thank you so much. I am blessed to have you. Two are better than one. And together we shall overcome all storms. Okay. Okay. Thank you very much. I appreciate you. Let's pray. Because I need God's grace now. What I'm favor. Remember the Bible says faith without work is what? It's dead. Therefore this morning we have brought into our midst somebody who is vast in this field to train us in this seminar. I'm talking about no other man than our dear friend Dr. Patrick, the Chief Executive Officer of Path Investments and will be taking us through this seminar. You're welcome, sir. Thank you very much. God bless. Thank you very much. Yes. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you very much, ladies and gentlemen. Please be seated. And uh, let me appreciate my pastor for the wonderful opportunity to make this presentation. A lot of people assume that when the grace of God is at work, one does not have to make any effort before succeeding. <laughs> but that's not true. That is not true. Actually, what the grace of God does is to empower you to work more than other people, thereby giving you more results. 
whatever you do remember do with all your heart as unto the Lord let me tell you as an employer of labor I've had several pastors recommend people for employment but unfortunately after interacting with the candidates I often discover that they have very little or nothing to offer you see employment is not based on sentiment but on performance and anointing does not replace performance hmm? rather anointing aids performance anointing facilitates performance so learn to do your job well and with integrity hmm? and let God's blessing come upon it to make you exceptional at the same time do not replace God with performance with hard work because actually it's the blessing of the Lord that make it rich without adding sorrow I urge you brethren rely on God for inspiration and then do your job well with a clear conscience before him you remember sir I mentioned last week uh, that I'm expecting the approval of a proposal from the Chinese government okay yeah. Believe it, sir. I just received a phone call that the approval has been given. <laughs> Praise God! Hallelujah! Wow, that's great. Thank you, the sir. The Lord is good all the time. Hi, that's a wonderful news. <laughs> Thank you, sir. Great. Thank you. Sir. Thank you sir. Ah, this is good. Thank you, sir. So, when are you now traveling? Ah, uh, tomorrow morning, sir. So soon? You know how these people work, sir. Uh, flight is 18 hours from Lagos to Shanghai and they gave us only 72 hours to put all documentation in place concerning the deal so I don't have much time again to, to spare in fact I just come for your fatherly blessing sir before I leave that's good <laughs> yes coming ah Robin yes sir good afternoon how are you this is Robin Adewale. Um, you know him. <laughs> Pastor, you want to test my attendance in church again? Okay. Who doesn't know Ben? The recently appointed uh, Bible study coordinator. <laughs> ben, you're welcome. Thank you, sir. <laughs> yes, this is the proposal, sir. Okay. We proposed that the program should take place in three months' time. Okay. This will give us the opportunity to generate enough hype on social media. Social media? Yes, sir. Why social media? Why don't we just concentrate on the television and newspapers? No, uh, no sir. We are targeting teenagers. And they watch less of television and hardly read newspapers. With social media, we can target specific groups, either according to their ages or interests. So, uh, wait a minute. What if we have more or less than the number expected? And don't you think that will affect our plans? We have made provision for that. Registration will be done online, even for our members. This will give us the opportunity to work on a reasonably reliable figure. Mm. First of all, this is a brilliant analysis. Yeah. I believe your employers are extremely lucky to have you. You will be no doubt a, an asset to your organization. What's the matter? Ben? 
problems. Ben, what's the matter? Pastor, have I said anything wrong? No, I don't think you have said anything wrong. Actually, bro, Ben has been unemployed for about seven years. Unemployed? Yes. Uh, he has written application letter to so many companies. He has attended interview in many companies too. But none of these companies has really employed him. Although the church has been trying to support him in a very little way, I think that Ben needs a job as a matter of urgency. This is not believable. Such an intelligent person. Yeah. Very intelligent and God fearing. Hmm. You did what? I thought the job has already been given out. I did not promise him anything specific. But I just knew that there's something special about Ben. You know I'm not sentimental about issues like this. I just love his sound judgment. That's all. You already asked Good Luck to come for the same job. And remember, Good Luck is your relation. How do you intend dealing with that? She wouldn't deserve the best from me. He trusts my judgment. And that's why he has asked that I recommend somebody for the position. The best we can do is get a candidate that will enhance the value of his company and not a liability. If Ben is better, so be it. But you don't know if Ben is better. All you have is the CV he gave to you at the pastor's office, right? And all you heard him say. Who knows? Maybe good luck is even more intelligent. You are a fair and God fearing man. You can't just decide that fate like that. <clears throat> You're right, my dear. There should be an objective way to know who is best for this position. I just prefer Ben because of his spirituality. I think I have a brilliant but simple idea. You see, one of the most valuable qualities in business is discipline. Some intelligent people don't have it. Let's test both of them on it. But how? I have asked both of them to come and see me by 4 p.m. The person that comes falls and on time. There's the job. Let's test their time management skills. Ah, that's my husband. <laughs> <laughs> Does the weather seem so right? Fast lane is not our fun, but our, our best. Does the weather seem so right? Good afternoon. Uh, my name is uh, Good Luck. Okay. I want to see the chief. He's expecting me. Okay. Thank you. Hello, my guy. <laughs> How you doing now? Yeah, I'm there already. <laughs> Don't worry, I will get the job. <laughs> ah, sure, we will celebrate.
just wait for me at the joint <laughs> i am going to come there immediately i leave this place okay <laughs> yeah talk to you later Ah, ah, my babe, how are you doing now? You're welcome, babe. Thank you, sir. You're welcome. Thank you, sir. Uh, give this to Chief William. I'm just expecting you. Uh, I'll be ready to resume work immediately. <laughs> He has assured me that a new official car and accommodation is waiting for you. Congratulations. Congratulations to Mr. Diwali. Thank you, ma'am. Thank you, sir. I'm short of words. I know you must be surprised. This job was meant for somebody, but as God will have it, that's God working for you. Oh my God. Congratulations. Thank you, ma. Congratulations, Nancy. I'm, I'm short of words. Hey. Hey, no, sir. I'm here, sir. My job, sir. Point of correction, my dear good Lord. It is now Ben's job. Oh. You came too late. Oh, 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 oh. 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 Uh, Sister Grace, Sir. why do you want to leave the Sanctuary Keeper's unit? Pastor, I feel I'm underutilizing my potentials for the Lord. I love caring for the house of the Lord, but I don't come in direct contact with people like the members of the counseling unit and the choir. Mm. Sir, how can I impact the life of people? But I don't relate with them. <laughs> In my unit, we complete our tasks long before people arrive for, for service and resume again after they have left. It doesn't really matter what you do in the house of the Lord. So far, He called you to do it and you are dedicated in doing it. It is acceptable before the Lord. Uh, Sister Grace. I thought you were convinced that God wanted you to care for his sanctuary. Yes, Pastor. And I still enjoy doing the work. But what if God feels I can do more than I'm doing for him? I desire to impact the life of people directly. Mm. My sister. There is no assignment that is inferior to the other. We all work together as the body of Christ. Remember, the body has different parts. If the nose wants to be the eyes, how will the body breathe? A body is not full of eyes. What is important is whatever you are doing, you do it as unto God and not unto men. Only the one who gave you your assignment can judge you. Pastor, please, let me join the counseling unit. Okay. If you insist, I, I permit you. I will not risk forcing you to remain in a unit you do not want, lest you sin and lose your blessing by not serving with your heart. Thank you, sir. Mm. Thank you, Pastor. Mm. Oh, 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 oh,
yo ye ni eni a wi fun o ba je o go eni a so ho ba je o ba si a ni o ko ko ta bi po ya oro olorun yo ma se ni oro to mu ni ga o wo ni so oro to ni la sha ti a wo ko How are you, my baby? Hi. What I do to say? You take care. Thank you, sir. So go back to train. In just three months, God has changed our stories as though we are never poor. Hmm. So much so that the pastor used us as illustration on Sunday of how God rewards faithfulness. Hmm. The pain of those days is nothing compared with the glory that God is revealing in us. God's word is ever true. You see, when God wants to transform the life of a man, it doesn't take a month. That is why God... Indeed. But before you turn this to a testimony service, the food is ready. Because usually when you enter the spirit, it will take the grace of God to make you stop. While we humans, <laughs> we go hungry. <laughs> so. Okay, okay. Um, I will postpone the salmon tea tomorrow. But for now, nobody is going to eat anything in this house until we have thanked the Lord for his good gift. Okay? Okay, accepted. But I will lead the prayers. It's all right. Okay. <laughs> Baba, <laughs> 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 Ah, Baba, I find my common bone when he go. 
Non si lèk beto djubari, il lò kan ma anko. Ek beto kan ba si koni se koupani. Ama ka ek beto kan te mi kon to se koupani. Il lò djen sade wado re ou. Ah! Ak pete rou. Po ba ti rin yon wi. Oreza ato bi to bi afo pe bu. Ek mi nan da iso. Ose mwore ni. O mwon kore kan lò fi o be nye di yon ma meni sou. Oh, for what I buy, oh, be bad, man, me lo ju. Oh, oh, si fe kore me lo. Me tog be me de yin nou. Hmm. Hmm. Ake te lo. Hmm. Bo, 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 lo ti in sinye bi yon ka bay. E yon ma se le si yon, yon ti yon ke de ni. O to yon ka yon da abe. Oh, so po an po, ni ba ba nge yon ni. E mi ni. E mi ni. Gotu gotu oni gotu. Nani nani ti nani ya nukusi nani ewa. Onda ju ama ti pa ye la kuko ya seda. E mini. Ah! Hmm. Sebo seri nou. Kodjuba lo. Hmm. Kuburu ko baje. O se de de. Eh. Kine kan wa baja uje. Apare go du tan lo. Eh, bo, bo, ni mo se le da o ma konon ma. Bo, ni. Ah, wo de yi. O ton ye man si nou to ti tu. Ah. Oran lo fo fon se, o ni a jade a da. Ah, ma kwe biti oran de. A jade a jade jube lo. Wo, a wo, mi ti te a wo oran re. Ah, koda. Mo ti se wadi de bipwe, mo mo ko yare. O ni, o ni, o ni. Eh, eh. Hmm. Oji mo kon yare. Ah. Ah. Oji pari ise. Oji pari ise. Hmm. Konka konka o gano kete. Hmm. Mo bo do re mi lo. Akita lo. Mo je wa wo. Fuck a bale. They say it's living the good life. More money, more friends, more cars. More, 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 I can have it all uh. Oh, oh, mm -mm. They say, win or lose game Get rich or die trying Is that really what the master says? When it's the fast lane Nobody's thinking what is right or wrong They say it's living the good life. More money, more friends, more cars. More, 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 more. I can have it all. Uh. Oh, oh, mm -mm. they say win or lose game. Get rich or die trying. Is that really what the master says? When it's the fast lane. Nobody's thinking what is right or wrong When it's the fast lane Everybody's fighting for their own Yes, man. Yes, yes. It's been a long time. How time flies. Oh. I remember the way you eat all my food and you stuff. Oh, forget. <laughs> oh, I'm sorry. How, how rude of me. Uh, this must be your wife. No, no, no. That's my girlfriend. You know, I don't have my, uh, you know, I don't have really have time for this marriage things, you know. Gee, they, you have not changed. Neither have you. I guess you're still going around with that, your Jesus, right? Uh, yes, yes. Uh, uh, Jesus has really been so. No, 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 not today, man. Maybe some other time, man. You see, um, here's my business card. You see, maybe we should get together sometime, you know, and catch up on old times. I'll come meet for you. Yeah. 
Jesus. Nice to see you, bro. Jesus. <laughs> What's up, bro? I can't forget you. Yeah. So we'll see you later. Eh? All right. Yeah. How time flies. Ah, this is my whole time friend. Schoolmate. Okay. Oh, well, are you done? No. I saw some dresses I love. I want you to check them before I buy them. Okay, let's go. Okay. Let's go and get them. Nonsense. Chidi, what? Who is this useless and jobless fellow? Who put this on my car? Hey, you! Come here! Chidi, it's okay. It's only a trap. It's nothing to get upset about. If you don't want it, throw it away. You don't need to arrest the poor man. Exactly my point. He's poor. That is why he's doing this. Instead of you to find a sensible job to do, you keep going about pushing your religion in people's faces. Do I look like I need to be saved to you? You this ignorant fool. You better go and find something good to do. Get your truck and get out of here. Nonsense. Get out of here. You are stupid. Stupid. That was really not necessary, you know. Nah. Are you also born again? If you are born again, follow him and do evangelism together. Dear Father, because I have the mind of Christ and the wisdom of God. For in Jesus' name I pray. Amen. Also, the internet penetration within the same year was 32.9%. It becomes even more interesting to note that in the same year, 2012, Nigeria came second on the list of top 10 countries with the highest Facebook mobile penetration with an amazing 87.9%. What better option is there for us than to explore this vast population for our product launch? 87.9% of Nigeria's population can instantly assess our campaign on their mobile devices on the move. I therefore submit that this is a revolutionary step we must take to reposition our brand. Thank you very much. Thank you. 
Start um, the project very soon. Good morning, sir. Good morning, Ben. Um, good morning, Chief. Oh, Ben, it's nice to see you. How is your wife and church? Fine, thank you, sir. How is mommy? Has she come back from Dubai? Oh, she she arrived yesterday. She sends her regards. Oh, you look good. <laughs> um, sir. Here's the file you requested for. Thanks so much. Please tell my secretary to come in for a moment. All right, sir. Please excuse me. You are excused. Look, I cannot stop thanking you for the choice of Ben. Ben is one of the best things that has happened to this company. Oh, thanks. Must be to go. I could not just let him go. I'm glad I didn't make a mistake. You see, Ben is so resourceful and diligent. I also admire his dedication to God. Sometimes we have some of our high profile clients insist on meetings on Sundays, but that is not for them. Nothing. Absolutely nothing can stop him from going to church on Sundays. I don't even bother to inform him about such meetings. Ben makes up for such meetings in several other ways. He's <laughs> highly dedicated to God. He's one of the very few that will be able to balance his responsibility at work, at home, and even in church. Yes, in fact, he is someone I call an all-rounder. <laughs> Uh, get me the documents I told you to prepare for chief. Oh, 
I have reviewed your quarterly reports and I'm not impressed at all. To say the least, Mike, your department has an all-time low performance and in my organization there is no room and there is no excuse for failure. Sir, actually, it is because of the new importation policy of the government. We, we could not... Could not what? <sighs> Why am I paying you good money if you cannot be resourceful? Everyone has a price. Couldn't you have penetrated into the office of the minister? I think you are getting to slow for my kind of game. I think I need someone more aggressive. Please sir, please just give me one more chance so that I will be able to... I'm sorry, that is a risk I am not willing to take. Yes sir, please sir, remember that my department led the overall rating performance for three straight years. We just have a rough time presently, and I, I can't... Or oh, perhaps you are losing your touch. Now, listen to me. I don't succeed sometimes. I don't even succeed at times. I do what? I succeed all the time. You are relieved of your position immediately. Sir? Clear out your desk and proceed on a three month suspension without pay. Sophia will take over your responsibilities. When you return, you move into her office because she will be operating from your old office. Yeah, Amara. You'll be going with me to Ghana tomorrow for two weeks. So, send your children to your grandma or something and uh, buy your husband something cheap as a compensation for the short notice. Okay? doing looking at me the meeting is over yes, some of your offices Hey, <laughs> Dile <laughs> I see me ni mu ni mu sakamu kikan mu si gbodo ni wure ki yayo je mi awo 
Borrow Chirino. I can tell you. You are not a Sorry, but why you buy here? Make me lori. Eh? You are not a Okay. Oh, okay. I will drop that. I will drop that. I will Enjoyed mommy's cooking. <laughs> I still have a lot to learn. That's mommy for you. But all glory to God. As you all know, every year we uh, host a worker in the church. Uh, this is just to appreciate all workers that we host. We know we can't pay you for your service to God because we know God Himself is the rewarder. The Bible says is a rewarder of they that diligently seek him, ah. and he will surely reward. All we do is to continue to encourage workers to continue to serve God and wait on God until their reward comes. It is also important to be motivated by our love for God and not by what people will say or what they will give us. At uh, this juncture, I want to, on behalf of my beautiful wife and family, welcome you and say God bless you. Sister Grace, this is a token from us. Thank you, sir. You're welcome. I've been so blessed spending today with you. So, the floor is open. Please help yourself. This strange feeling. It's like a burden I can't explain. Is, is everything all right? Maybe God is trying to tell you something. Yes, but I don't know what. Could it be about Baba or Mama in the village? No, no, no. I'm certain of that. So how do we pray if we don't know the prayer point? Let's pray in tongues. The Holy Spirit helps our infirmity. For we do not know what to pray about as we hold to. Come on, let's pray. Let's pray in Jesus' name. This is our biggest account yet. And all hands must be on deck to ensure absolute success. Although Ben is handling the account, but we all know that the future of this company depends on the outcome of the campaign. Not only are we going to make a fortune out of this project, it is also going to establish us as a global brand. Tomorrow, unfailingly, we will send the final draft of the publicity schedule to Vintage Group for approval. Ben. Yes, sir. Please bring the proposal so that we can see if there's any last minute addition to add to it. The chairman is 
What's no way is taking so long? Please tell him all right there. And the proposal seems to have disappeared. Ah. of all days to, to waste our time. I wonder. Huh? But you know how busy we all are. Exactly. I, I, I'm, I'm sorry. I'm just trying to find a proposal. Alright. We know how desperate you are now, Ben. Um, but take your time. Just search for it carefully. Ah, what's happening here? Uh, sir, this irresponsible fellow has misplaced the proposal. What? Ben! Look, no, no, no. Tell me it's not true. It, it can be true. Uh, I'm, I'm sorry, sir. Uh, I'm trying to look for it. Uh, I'll find it. Look, you are better. Ben, you, you are better find it. No sense. Don't worry, Ben. I told Pastor that I joined this church six weeks ago. Before then, I had a lot of problems and was battling with a depression. So much that I contemplated suicide several times. So, a psychologist advised that I should avoid being alone anytime I was depressed. But one day, I felt the hopelessness so hard again that I wanted to die. So I ran out of the house. While walking around aimlessly, I saw this church holding a service. It me that it was safer for me to be in the midst of a crowd. I entered the church. But as soon as I sat down, I felt a body lifted off me. Ma, I have never felt such a peace in my life before. Never. So that was why I joined this church. In a bit to spend more time and enjoy my newfound peace, I came much earlier to church one day when the sanctuary cleaners were cleaning the auditorium. While waiting for them to finish up so I could come in, I observed uh, a few of them were talking and laughing while you were praying as you swept and clean. I noticed that you laid your hand on every single chair you cleaned and prayed that God would lift up people's body. That was when I knew the reason for the miracle that happened to me the first day I came to this church. Ma, it means you had prayed for me even before I came here. Thank you very much. God bless you. Oh God! <laughs> I'm so insensitive. <laughs> So you can use me there? <laughs> I, I felt you just have to listen to this testimony. Anyway, the senior pastor would like to interview you for your new unit. That's going to be the final <laughs> stage for your transfer. Pastor, transfer to where, sir? Ah, I'm not leaving the sanctuary unit. 
I'm sorry I didn't listen to you earlier. I want to, I want to remember where God has placed me. If I don't find that proper tomorrow, I may lose my job. God forbid. You will find it in Jesus' name. Wherever it is, God will bring it out. Do you remember you said you had a strange feeling this morning before going to work? I believe that was God warning us that something was about to happen. We brought the best suggestion by asking us to pray in tongues. Since we didn't know what the problem was. Oh. That's true. And the Bible says that we should not worry about anything. But in everything, through prayers, supplications, and thanksgiving, we should make our request known to God. And, and, and the, the peace, peace of God that surrounds all understanding will guard our hearts. hearts. <sighs> Thank you, Jesus. Then we don't need to be about it again, since God knows about it. Let's just begin to thank God. Let's just appreciate it. Thank you, Lord.